or sure. you do, you know. But yeah, everything you respect every weapon that's on the offense, but you know, you stay true to who you are. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. okay. Hey, great. Something completely different. How'd you get your uniform number? How'd you pick 52? it? 52? Yeah. Uh, so I came. Um, they, that's the one that they gave me. Oh, yeah, so you didn't have a certain one. <laughs> nah, nah, and then I tried to change it like my freshman or sophomore year, and my position coach at the time, Coach Acuff, I was like, hey, I'm going to go change my number to like 13 or something. And he was like, nah, I like you in 52. <laughs> I was like, uh, all right. <laughs> so you're locked so, yeah. in there. Uh, you think y'all are the best dressed team here definitely, today? Definitely. Best the... hair, best jewelry. <laughs> Look at this. Gorgeous. <laughs> Did y'all make a decision to be flashy as a group or just uh, each individual guy get their style? Well, I mean, or? Coach Rule just believes in, you know what I'm saying, going wherever you are, you're, you're professional wherever, and this is a business trip, you know what I'm saying, we're coming to, to represent our teammates and our program, so, you know, just an opportunity to look good, you know, and the flash and stuff is just the individual, so. You talk about looking good, Baylor's, you know, the, the uniform rotations and things sort of got mm -hmm. a reputation the last few years. What do you think about that? And, you know, programs like y'all in Oklahoma State who uh, switched things up and gone a, a different route maybe than not I love some it. of the traditional programs. I love it. There's so many different combinations. And it's uh, like last season, like there's so many, you know, we didn't get to the ones that we wanted to or whatever. But like this year, we're like, this, we're, the, we're the seniors. We're going to pick them. But I love the uh, the different combinations, the black, the gold, the different face masks and what have you. It's, it's great. I think it just adds like a little something to look forward to game day, you know. Greg, Coach Rule talked about the turnover game this morning, about how you guys have to turn around that part of things on defense, create more opportunities for your offense. Talk about what you and that defensive line can do this year to help. Uh, well, I mean, the, the key to being in a good defense alignment is disruption. So if we're putting a guy two, three yards in the backfield and we're getting to the ball, we're aggressive on the ball, you know. What I think what Coach Will talked about was doing your job and then stripping the ball. So it's just the next level as far as, like, being a lead and being a better player. So when you get to the ball, you strip it. It's like a constant, um, like something that's constantly on your mind to do. Like, you're never satisfied with just making a tackle or just getting a sack. Like, we always... Well, what we used to call it was you just sharing, you know, so don't be so selfish when you get to the ball, like let everybody else eat, so cause fumbles, picks, you know, what have you, whatever. Have you made any scheme changes or have you noticed any scheme changes to help put you guys in better positions to make those plays? No, that's like, a, that's like a, a personal, like you just, as a player, you have to be conscientious of, of stripping the ball. It's not anything schematic, so. Thank you. Greg, obviously, you've been a better for a long time. You've been through a lot, you know, the ups and downs. What do you feel this program is right now since Coach Rolls come in and had a year to kind of establish himself, establish where this identity of this program is going forward? I think we're finally getting back to where we were. I think I, just as far as, like, foundational and having personnel and having a system and having, you know, a little tradition and stuff like that. I think we're, we're getting back to where that is, and I think this – this season will propel us more forward into whatever else that Coach Rule wants to take the program to. So I think that's the biggest, the, it's kind of the calm after the storm at this point, you know what I mean? And so the luxury of that is you don't have to, I don't have to focus on everything else. I can just focus on football, which makes life so much easier. I mean, clearly people will look at the record last year, but their record is not really reflective mm -hmm. of what you guys did. Mm -hmm. Talk about that a little bit, just what you guys learned. I mean, clearly you'd have wanted to win a lot more games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, um, I think if you're looking at the record, you know, obviously nobody likes that. Um, but like you said, if you're watching the ball games, you know, <clears throat> it, it tells a different story. I think the biggest thing we could take from last year is, is just finishing, you know what I mean? And, and coming out fast and, and not letting up. And when we do get up, you know, like putting our foot on their throat and things of that nature. And I think last year we were really young and even like the older guys like myself and what, what have you, we, we hadn't led a team to be great, you know, and, and I think now everybody's ready for that transition. You know, everybody's prepared to go into that. You know, We don't know what it looks like, but we're ready to go into it. You know what I mean? If that makes sense.